What is going on guys? It is your boy Cash and today we are going to have some fun, some fun, some fun. I did this a long time ago. We looked at all the SSR S3 animations and I was like, yo, it would be really funny right now. There's probably going to be some dead time in the game. So why not go through all the SSR S3 animations and pick out a top 10. But more importantly, I want to show you guys on the left side where you see Cinder. I'm going to have you guys make a top 10, but it's going to be out of a bunch of the people making a top five. So this, here's how it works. I'm going to put the instructions on the left side of the screen. You guys go through the codex just like I'm about to do. Obviously, I'm going to edit out a lot of mine. You're going to go through, check out all your little S3 animations, see which ones you like the most. You can easily do it by this. Go here and just check out the S3s. <laughs> See which ones you actually like. And with that being said, you're going to make a top five. I'm going to go through all my comments as I normally do. This is not new. I, I always check my comments. And I'm going to take your top fives and I'm going to compile them. And I'm going to see who has the most votes pretty much. And then that is going to make a top ten. Don't give me a top ten. I'm only going to consider your top five. Don't make a top five with multiple people in multiple spots because that's not going to count either. So just give me a top five. I'm going to accumulate it from... YouTube, I'm probably going to even accumulate it from Reddit. I'm going to post it on Reddit and I'm going to see all you guys picks and then I want to make a top 10 out of that. But I'm going to give you guys in this video my top 10. So hopefully you guys have some fun. We can have some fun. The Ruby collab event is going down. It's about this like this last week. So let's just have some fun. Let's enjoy the last little essence of it by just having some more fun in the game by looking at some S3 animations and making a judgment call. And if you want to, you can differentiate between a costume over the regular. So this is Secret Agent Morgan's. As you can see, it's in like a different thing. She has a different outfit. I think the outfits do add an aesthetic to the actual ultimate. So if you think that this is better than Standard Morgan's, it's still the same like setting, but maybe you like the Sakura background with the, the, the blossoms and or the other one makes it look cooler in the outfit. That is fair game. So if you want to put Morgan and then Secret Agent Morgan, that's fine. Of course, I know that the outfits just came in. Those are going to count too, guys. It's all up to what they just dropped. So feel free to put in the newest margarita, whatever you want. All those are fair game. All right, guys, I finally finished my list. This took me a long time. I went through every single SSR in the game, including all the collaborations, and I finally got my top 10. So here we go. Let's just start off with number 10. For number 10, I'm going to pick Riza. The reason why is because the way that she just goes ham in this is just too much. Shot, 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 shot. Switch to the other gun. Lock it up. Bow. Slow motion on the bullet and the nice little freeze frame afterwards. Beautiful. It's just, it's just executed really good for a character that just has nothing but a bunch of guns at her arsenal. So I really, really loved it. For number nine, I have to go with the boy Christian. Now he just has this overwhelming power with this. I forgot what anime it is. Like was it Gurren Lagann, where like you know the guy with the spear, or the pierce the heavens. It's such a strong, the spear of judgment, so strong. It's like ah, ah such force, and clearly overkill. Clearly overkill for pretty much any single target <laughs> that it's trying to kill. So I love things that look strong. They look very powerful. I love the, the animation and the camera work in that move. Next up is going to be Standard Ashley. I just love his nonchalant demeanor. So casual. Let me just summon that. Walks away. Explodes on him. <laughs> really, really just like he looks so strong when he's doing it. He just looks like... Like, he has overwhelming power, doesn't matter, I know it's gonna get the kill, kind of thing. And I just love the confidence that he has as he's doing it. Next up is gonna be Nikita. Just because of how funny the character is and how playful she is, a lot of characters, I feel like these women with these miniguns always have this playful, like, I'm just gonna blow everything up kind of, <laughs> kind of mentality, so. Comes out the helicopter, throws the grenades for the entrance, finds the gun, laces you up 
just really cool how like she pretty much has like a little intro and like every character has like an intro but she makes it very dramatic she's obviously over dramatic she's very very into herself and throws the grenades literally just for the entrance side of it because all she's really coming down there to do is hit you with the guns so i just like how over dramatic it is and how funny it is next up is gonna be my girl yang 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 yes she's coming in at number six i just love obviously the animation and especially at the end as we see don't mind the outfit but the combination and then the last hit here ah the camera work that you just fly backward camera work in which you just kind of fly backward just like from the impact of what she just did to you is just amazing she yeah, had i'm a little biased but as you can see i'm not too biased she did come in at number six but it's just a really really cool move that she has and just that that whole combination is just it's just ridiculous Kind of makes me wish that the other characters, uh, Standard Ruby and Nina, kind of had like a combination attack like that. Next up is going to be Cyberpunk Nemesis. It's a character I actually do not have, so I have to show it through the codex, but I really love how amazing the background. Nem regular Nemesis is really cool, but the background in here, and it kind of makes this make more sense, like the whole electromagnetic thing and then of course the, the cone is pretty good in that animation as well i just think that that looks a lot better and it makes a little bit more sense to her power you know i don't know it just really explains it really well and it just really looks good with that background and you know most of us don't have it because it was a special skin but now everyone has the power coming in at number four sea goddess well sublime sea goddess margarita this animation is so clean it's coming in at number four because there's a couple other ones that I have a little bit more special place in my heart for, but it looks amazing. Let's look at it. Opens the shell and it just looks like, you see her eyes? It's the eyes, man. It's really the eyes. It's, it's the eyes that really take it away from me. I really feel like she just looks like she just is like actually she still has that murderous kind of intent in her eyes and in that you know she's trapping you in the sea in the shell and then she's gonna perform like some type of ritual or something like that it just looks phenomenal really really good work coming in at number three it has to go to my girl Morgan the old school when this character first dropped everyone was in love with her you saw her everywhere she was like the first character to get an ignored defense on an s3 that nuked and un unable to revive she was all the rage but what was really really cool about her was this s3 animation <laughs> you see the eyes straight through boom you're dead it was just really cool to see something like that like and, and then you know you got the kill and it was unable to revive and you she was slashed through you now the reason why i like this one over the secret agent one is because i just like the scenery i love the scenery with the blossoms in the back it just gives you that old martial artist movie kind of feel to it instead of you just getting taken out in some random alleyway so that's really why i choose this one over the other one but don't you worry, there's definitely some secret agent up on this list. Coming in at number two, I gotta give it to Secret Agent Verdandi. Now, standard Verdandi's all it looks pretty cool, but the little imp, the little differences of this one really makes this character looks like a, some type of secret specialized agent. Even her design is really cool. Like she looks like she's fused with stuff. Look at this animation. Like she's like teleporting, digitizing through places. And then the end, the shot is used with like a scope, like a like she has a, like a scope in her eye. Like it's it's really well done. And just just because of the fact that she looks like she is some type of special agent like secret agent uh, well-kept secret kind of character meanwhile Morgan's it just looks like she's just dressed in like a regular like you know trench coat or something like that and she just takes you out in the alley this looks a lot better this man is definitely revered as one of the worst characters in the game and you know I understand I get it whatever but some of the characters that I put on this list are mostly single target, if you guys have noticed that. But the characters that are AoE, I like when they make it look like crazy that it's AoE. Margarita takes many people's souls. Nemesis definitely targets a bunch of people and then annihilates them in that big explosion. But when it comes down to an AoE skill that definitely looks like it hits AoE and does massive damage, you can't go any further than the boy Haspel. Look at it, it's called Terminate. Mm. Like it just, it looks satisfying, it's, it's, it looks too clean, 
I, I just think it's the best animation in the game so far. I can't deny it, it just looks too good. It just looks way too good. So that's gonna be my top 10. Give me your top five and I hope that I can see you guys in the next video with all you guys picks combined with YouTube and Reddit and we should have a fun blast. It's gonna be a nightmare to edit, but it should be pretty fun. Hope you guys enjoyed yourselves and I hope you guys enjoyed my list. You guys feel free to disagree with it. Well, why would you put that there? I'm really interested to see what you guys pick because I know some people are just gonna be like, I thought this was cute, so I picked the cutest thing I could find. I respect that, you know, definitely respect that. Um, or this one was really ugly or it looked fun to me, so I just, I don't know, I liked it ever since. You know, weird stuff. It doesn't have to be like politically correct or any stupid thing like that. Anyway, but remember, every day at the casino is your lucky day and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace. Oh.